Whoa. <laughs> New camera. <gasps> wow. I feel like it captures much more. Hello my friends, it's Nina and today I am taking you to another country. In today's video, we are packing to go to Japan for the first time. At least it's the first time for me. I am so excited. It has not hit me that I'm going to Japan. It also hasn't hit me that I have to travel a lot tomorrow in less than 24 hours. So if you didn't know, I am going to travel for the next month. I am going to be in Japan for less than two weeks and then I'm going to be in Korea for a month. And I'm packing the day before, as I usually do. But this trip is special because I am actually traveling with my friend. I am traveling with my longtime friend, Amanda. Some of you may know who Amanda is. She's also known as Amanda Rachel Lee on YouTube and every social media. But Amanda and I have been planning this trip since early this year. I think literally since the beginning of this year, maybe even late last year. We have been planning for Japan and Korea. We've had so many phone calls with each other. So I will be meeting up with Amanda in Japan. I am so excited. We are going to Tokyo and then we're going to Osaka and Kyoto. That's also why I've been trying to learn some more Japanese lately. But for now, I am going to pack. I'm going to take you with me. I have to pack a range of late summer, early fall outfits. So that's going to be a challenge, but I also plan to shop a lot when I'm in Japan and Korea. Yeah, without further ado, let's get packing. I'm bringing this bag right here from Monos, and then I have a matching carry-on right here that also has a laptop sleeve. So this is all I'm bringing. I think for starters, let's just pack our clothes. That's always the hardest thing to do. Now come along with me. Hello. Let's lay this down. <laughs> I'm texting Amanda right now, we're both struggling to pack. So we're going to Japan the beginning of October. So Tokyo is going to be, oh my God, it's 83 right now. This is the weather in Tokyo right now. 75 and above the entire week that we're there. Just when I was ready for fall weather, it's still summery weather, okay. So my mission, there I am. So my mission is to narrow down my choices there. All right, let's see what we can do. First things first, outerwear. I have this cute faux leather jacket. I don't even think it's like faux leather. It's nylon maybe. It has these drawstring details here. It's very lightweight, but it looks heavy. And I feel like it can protect me from cold weather. I definitely will pack this. I got this in Korea. Got it in a little boutique, so I can't really tell you where it's from. I honestly don't remember. So this one's for sure going in. This will look cute with outfits and it's very lightweight. So I'm gonna bring this, another one. So we've got two jackets. Leather jackets are always a staple when you travel, but I want a new one. But leather jackets are hard to find. So I don't know if I want to bring one that I'm comfortable wearing already or if I should just leave this. It's not the heaviest jacket, but if I'm gonna shop, <sighs> don't forget to try out your pieces as well. <gasps> this is such a solid jacket. Dang it, it's cute. Okay, I'm bringing this. Maybe I don't even need to get a leather jacket. I always bring this when I travel, so it would have felt weird if I didn't bring it this time. Okay, now I have three jackets. Yeah. This is a popular style, but it's so heavy. This was always easy to throw on. I'll also wear this and see how I actually feel about it. Dang it, it's cute. Uh. This is hard. I don't know how people narrow things down. This is the first time I'm also not using a table. I usually plan out my outfits on Notion, but because I forgot to account for warmer weather, that table, that database, it's no longer useful. I had to scrap it. So I'm doing this on the spot. <sighs> I'm not very good at doing things on the spot. <laughs> I don't think I will bring this just because it is very heavy. If I really need a heavier jacket, maybe I'll buy one, but I'm not bringing this. I also wore this a lot in my last Korea trip. It's time to wear different things. I actually bought this in Korea too. Other pieces we need, we need a lot of long sleeves. I love long sleeves. And I know in Korea, it's going to be cooler. Oh, so Korea, we're entering the low 70s, 60s. I have a black turtleneck. I have a white turtleneck. Those are in the laundry right now. This is also one of my favorite tops, a white long Long sleeve with this black stripe, definitely a staple. Very easy to wear, keeping this as well. <gasps> I love this top. Can't really see the details, but there is this nice scoop neck. I love showing my collarbones. And then it's also a comfy long sleeve as well. I love the stitching detail. <gasps> then I have this long sleeve, but it has this shoulder pop out detail. I have so many black long sleeves, but I have to bring it. I have to. Dang. <laughs> Other than that, I don't think we're going to be that cold. I have a few laundry loads going, so we're not quite done with clothing, but I think this is all I have for what's in this area of my wardrobe. I got a couple new tops recently. Definitely bring this one. This top can go with pretty much all of my pants. Also, I got a flu shot today. My arm's a little sore. And then I also have a white one that I'm going to try on. This is from Love Bonito. Let's try the white one on. <gasps> ah! Wow, this is very fancy looking. I'm gonna bring it. 
Hello. I think the next thing we can pack is my carry-on. So I have all my makeup here. Let's start with our technology. I'm gonna pack all of my cards, my little SD cards into this hard shell case. Got a couple SD cards in here. This is my tech bag from Herschel. This has a bunch of sleeves. Oh, there's actually something in here. Oh, there's a book. Should I bring a book? I have other things I need to do. People wonder why I still use my old iPad when it comes to my webtoon. It's because I actually have not figured out how to work the cloud for Clip Studio Paint. That's my own fault. I'm also, all of the brushes that I downloaded into this iPad, I'm too lazy to figure that out with a new iPad. So I'm going to bring my old iPad. I have no time to figure out how to change things. I'm too lazy to configure all the brushes and stuff. That's why I have my old iPad. Honestly, I didn't even realize it's old until people said it was old. <laughs> I also do have my new iPad here, but unfortunately I'm still not used to my new iPad, so this is going to stay. I can understand why people compare my old one with my new one, but to me, I don't know, they seem the same. So here's my old iPad. It is at what battery? <gasps> Did it die? <gasps> it died! No! Oh my god, I hope I saved everything. So I'm gonna charge my iPad. I also found my comb. This is a foldable comb. Has this end to fix your roots, but also got the comb. At the same time, we're saving space. Love this. I also love that it's pink. I'm going to use probably this new case here. Oh, this comes off? Wow. Why? This is my drawing glove for my iPad. This case I use for all of my technology and chargers. My makeup. I'm so used to this bag. I have this little makeup bag. I think there's going to be some days where I might have to bring just a bag of makeup with me and I don't want to carry this giant thing. So this is still, it's still a maybe. Let's pack my makeup bag. First things first, a big Clio cushion. This is the Kill Cover, the new foundware in ivory. This is my favorite. And then this is my main eyeshadow palette. This is is from Roman. It's just a nice pink. I'm still kind of confused whether this is cool tone or warm tone. On the website it says cool tone, but I feel like it's more of a neutral. I'm curious to see after I take my personal color test what my color palette is. I'm assuming for some reason, I'm in between winter cool or spring warm. Summer cool, eh, but I'm pretty sure I'm between winter cool or spring warm. Those are completely different ones, but just at the same time, I feel like I wouldn't be surprised if I'm warm tone. So this is the only palette I'm bringing. It's very small. This is literally the eye makeup I'm wearing right now. I also have my favorite eyebrow pencil. This is from Unleashia. It's a very microscopic tip. I rarely see it. And then it has a spoolie end as well. Glitter pencil. This helps with my egg yolk high. And I think we have a good amount left. Along with that, I have my blush. This is the Sisua Strawberry Vanilla Blush. This is my favorite blush. I'm wearing it right now. Kind of wish it was a little more compact, but it's still cute packaging. I apply this with a brush, and this is my favorite blush brush, so I'm just going to leave that in here. I have an eyeshadow brush. I have this fine line flat brush, but I don't really use it. This I don't use right now, so I'm just going to put it away. Gotta save space. Pencil liner. I'll keep it just in case. <sighs> I really love this lip tint, but right now I'm going towards this pink color. <sighs> this one is also going to take a nap. Thank you for your time. But this is what I use currently. So I have this in my purse. This is my first one, so it's kind of running out. I have, oh, I have my emergency pouch. I should probably empty my actual bag. This bag I'm bringing for sure. It's kind of a Mary Poppins bag. It just fits so much. I have gum, pack of tissues. I have my favorite mirror. I've had this since middle school. I'm really good at keeping things. I'm a very loyal person. Person. <laughs> this is my favorite lip balm, the Vaseline Lip Therapy Rosy Lips Lip Balm. And then I have this highlighter from Peripera. I like to put this on my nose. I like to put this everywhere, so. I have a highlight brush here. Favorite eyeliner, this is the Kill Lash Super Proof Mascara Long Curling from Clio. I need to buy more of these. And then just in case I have a gel eyeliner. I haven't been really using gel eyeliner lately because I like the stronger, long-lasting look of liquid eyeliner, as you can see right now. Gives me a good cat eye. And then I have tweezers. I always keep tweezers on me, so that's staying in here. Let's see what I can find. It. Oh, and then this is my double concealer. It has a nice pencil tip here, and then it has a liquid side here. I love this. This is from the Sem. I've used this for since I was in college. I used it for since I was in college. <laughs> oh, of course. Eyelash curler. Is that really everything? That was my makeup pouch. Here is my emergency pouch. As I said, this is a Clio compact. Do I actually need this though? I don't really find myself using it. 
I might have a little to-go case of floss. Oh, my favorite lip gloss. This is also from Peripera. This is the Ink Glosting Lip Gloss. I have my perfume. I have another lip balm. Let's see how much I have left. This is pretty good. I have a bunch of band-aids. I have a lot of hair ties as well. I'm gonna keep these in here. I have actual floss. Then I also have my favorite Neosporin. You never know when something can happen. And then I have these mints. These are on their way of running out. Maybe when the box is empty, I can use this for something else. But that's my emergency pouch. Gonna fill it right up. <laughs> I love how this just fits. Ah. So this is going into my backpack. I'm going to pack this bag into my suitcase. <laughs> nice, what time is it? It's only 8 o'clock. I have this converting thing. It's good for travel, especially because we're going to an Airbnb. A lot of hotels in Korea have outlets for Americans, and I'm sure the bigger hotels in Japan do as well. But I'm bringing this just in case because we do have a bunch of Airbnbs we're going to. And it also just has a lot of outlets so you can charge multiple things at once right in here. This is also going in. Yay, on to the next. I am also doing last minute checks to see how much storage I have on this laptop. I am quitting most of my applications. And I also like to leave my devices on airplane mode, just in case. I don't know if I explained this, but I am going to LA at 5 in the morning or 7 in the morning, and then we're going to land at 9 a.m. My flight to Japan is at 1 p.m., so I think I might have time to kill at a business lounge. So I might actually just work tomorrow as well. 139 gigabytes, that's decent. I also packed my SSD. This is a compact little device that holds so much, it has a cord with it as well. My passport. Silly me. Can't leave the country without a passport. In this cute case going in here. I don't need to charge my laptop, so I'm going to pack the charger as well. Next up, I'm gonna pack my hair stuff. I'm just wondering what kind of things I wanna put in my hair. I have these bows that I think would be cute, just like on the side of my head sometimes. I'm gonna put them into this little pouch. I got this on YesStyle, 3CE. And then I also have beige ones because I do have some white clothes. I think that would be a nice, cute look. Got an empty jewelry case. I am going to pack this statement necklace from OHT NYC or Oat NYC. It's a very cool necklace. And then I have this necklace, this necklace, and I've got a bracelet. Then I'm gonna pack my earrings in here. Three pairs. That's all I need. I just wear the same three. I have triple piercings. Here we have two studs. Isn't my camera cute? Then we've got the huggy earrings here. Necklace, more necklaces, bracelets. All good to go. This is all the jewelry I need. Oh, and this is also the hand sanitizer that I'm bringing. It's from Touchland or Touchland. And this is the Berry Bliss scent. I have more hair accessories. This is my favorite clip. And then I'll pack this. This is smaller than my usual hair clips that I have. So if I want to wear like a half updo, this is the perfect size. It's all in here. I think that's enough hair accessories and I want to buy more. So I'm going to put this into my check-in. I'll probably have all of my camera stuff in here. And then I have this little pouch for batteries. For instance, these are the batteries for my Vixia Mini going in here. So cute. They're a little cushioned inside. Extra GoPro batteries going in here. This is so cute. I think that's all I need for the cameras. I'm bringing this camera, that camera, GoPro, three cameras, and then my phone. Yes. GoPro I'm going to carry in my backpack. GoPro Hero 12 in black. I have a pouch for my pads. I'm gonna be on my period later in the trip. I'm not sure if I want to bring too many pads. I manage with pads in Korea, so I'll pack probably three. Meanwhile, I can give you a haul of things that I got to travel with. I have gone to Target, CVS. Here are some of my travel essentials. First off, we've got Kleenex. This will go in my backpack. Next up, toothbrush. It has a little cover on it. Razors, two razors. I'm gonna pack it just like this. They have covers. Hand sanitizing wipes, disinfecting wipes, eye makeup remover, and micellar water makeup remover. This is my favorite one. So these are my go-to products for removing my makeup. This is all I need. And a sleeve of cotton, toothpaste, daily moisturizing lotion. So this is the lotion for my body. I have my contact lenses. My eyes are different levels, negative five, negative six. And these are for astigmatism. Something new that I got, I got the sheet soaps or soap sheets. 
So you throw this into your bag. Something else I've heard is that if you're traveling around, sometimes you'll go to a public restroom that might not have soap. And I've actually encountered this in Korea. Sometimes at restaurants or cafes, there's a bathroom and there's no soap. I actually bought paper soap. These are all individual sheets and you just keep it in your bag. This is rose scented. And then I have a jasmine scented one as well. Maybe I'll give it to Amanda if she wants one. And that is pretty much my haul for extra stuff. I think now I'm going to go to the bathroom and pack up all of my toiletries. That is very important. More new goods. This is my face wash. My favorite serum. Another favorite serum of mine. Oh, I guess I do have a new one. I'll keep this here. New sunscreen. These are precious. I have another. This one's coming with me. Ooh, my essence. This is my ginseng essence water. Snail Trusica Miracle Repair Serum. And a new face wash. I have been using this shower hair band here, so it's gonna stay here. I have this one from KCON. Gonna refill these flossers. Don't need to bring this. Razor right here. I already have contact lenses. moisturizer, tinted sunscreen, regular sunscreen, and I don't need this. Toothbrush, toothpaste, these can go in here as well. Oh, <laughs> so much skincare. I feel like I could pack these in here as well. Yes, heck yeah. Perfect, all of my toiletries. Packing my backpack, put my iPad on airplane mode. Laptop sleeve. <laughs> Wi-Fi is off. Maybe you can feel the pressure that I I want to wash my hair so bad. I can say that it's been on my mind, but I'm moving along. So, charging a car, none for me so good.
속에 터져가는 사람들 사이에 다가오는 표정들 뒤에 Maybe one day Maybe one day It'll feel horizontal wow <laughs> more cool tone. <laughs> got back from the convenience store. This is our haul. We got the pudding. The infamous pudding. We got some chicken chips and then we've got another pudding. I got a chicken. I don't know what this one is. I know. This one's kind of like round though. Tuna mayo. Mm -hmm. And then I got grape candy. And that's it. Itadakimasu. Itadakimasu. This is season really nice. Surprisingly, I'm not as tired as I thought I would be considering mm -hmm. the flight situation. My flight was delayed by almost four hours. So basically like my 12 hour flight turned into like a 16 hour flight. Mm. And then I went to LA. <laughs> oh my God. Both of us have had- We had a, a chaotic journey. flying day. Over here. Mm. It's Nina's first time in Japan. It's my second, but I haven't been in like four years. So we're both excited to see what they did over mm -hmm. the last like three years. Don't look at me. <laughs> I fell apart. Oh, actually, that's exactly what I needed. Mm -hmm. How cute. You didn't have any nutrients today. I actually ate a lot of vegetables, which is good. Because mm, I always mm. like nutrients when I travel. You need to try this. <gasps> this is the best grape I've ever had. These are big grapes. Wait, it tastes like not like the grapes we have in Canada. Whoa! It's like not grape flavor. It's really sweet. It doesn't taste like a grape. It's just really sweet. Well, like nicely sweet. It's like sugar grape. Mm. Whoa! I love everything grape flavored. That's why I got these too. Cool. Oh, you're so. I'm just you're multilingual. So, you're so Nihon. <laughs> Nihon Jin Des. Is it gummy? I don't know. Oh, they're like jelly beans. Okay, that's <gasps> not exactly what I expected. Oh, cute. Ooh, smell. 
don't know if I love that. I like the Ew. flavor. But the I don't texture. like the, the texture. It's like really it's so hard. chewy. It's gonna take my fillings out. <laughs> Do you have a first since I'm eating tuna? <laughs> Whoa, up there? It's like, <laughs> well, this kind of obvious, but it's like very custardy. <laughs> I just thought it would be like more like um milky. Mmm. But it's like eggy. Mmm. Mm. That's really good. I'm actually what like, do you rate it. Ooh. Out of ten. It's ooh, like this a, is super chewy. Like an eight. Eight. It's nice. Ooh. You know what I mean, right? Oh, that's it's good. Like sweeter. Oh, that's nice. Mmm. Not my favorite chip flavor. I don't know if it tastes like chicken. No. No. <laughs> it's like a nicely seasoned. It kind of tastes like like MSG flavors. <laughs> True. Bye. Bye. See you tomorrow.